anime and sports have a lot of things in common. Not really, but it's two things that I really enjoy. I mean, look at the physical specimen that is my body. I look like I'm straight out of Baki. So today, I'm going to be comparing our favorite anime characters to some of our favorite athletes. I'm not going to be including sports animes like Haiku or Conqueror's Basketball for the main reason of them being mid, and also they're already about sports, so it would be pretty obvious to compare this motherfucker to Shaq. Now, if you disagree with any of these comparisons, then too bad. It's not like LeBron is going to act like your favorite kawaii character, but take these comparisons with a grain of salt. Intro. Intro. I wonder what that would be. I wonder what that would be. Ray Rice was a star running back for the Baltimore Ravens for six seasons, seen as one of the best in the league, so who could I compare him to? Beerus. Now what does the God of Destruction have in common with a star football player? Let's get the obvious out the way, they both hit a woman and knocked her out. It's actually eerily similar how both of these events played out. Woman hits the man first, the man hits back with a force a hundred times of hers, and in retaliation, a third party intervenes to get back. The third party for Beerus being Vegeta fighting back, and Ray pretty much got blackballed out the league, so that was his third party. Ray and Beerus both had to go through character redemption arcs. Ray is still on this journey and probably still will be because when I think of Ray Rice, I don't think of Super Bowl champion. I think of elevator superpowers. Beerus was pretty much the laughing stock of the Z fighters, but lately he's been proving himself more and more. Now you might say Floyd Money Mayweather shouldn't be compared to Luffy, but I say otherwise. Sure, Luffy is a lot more goofy than Floyd, but they still have a lot of similarities. Luffy's double fruit allows him to stretch out, pause, and harden his body like his fist, for instance. And we know Floyd can pack a punch, so fighting wise, I think they're on point, but intelligence wise, they are the most alike. Personally, I don't think Floyd or Luffy can read one full page of a Harry Potter book, and if they can, I will donate 750 cents to any charity they choose. Mbappe is one of the most promising young players in soccer, and at such a young age is already so talented and has quite a few achievements. It's only natural to have him be Naruto. Naruto's ultimate goal is to become Hokage, and Mbappe wants to become the greatest soccer player ever. While we already know Naruto goes on to become Hokage, achieving his dream, the young Mbappe still has a lot to prove. Oh, and their taste in women is almost identical to each other. Come on, we all know Naruto clapped Haku's cheek. Now Karl Malone and Bond from Seven Deadly Sins, just like Naruto and Mbappe, both had the same taste in, uh, women? Alright, let's be real, they're little ass kids. What? But the third leading scorer in NBA history and the legendary immortal Bond have other things in common, right? Like Bond is a pretty cool and strong and uh, Carl was called the mailman because he always delivers and Bond also you know what they don't have much in common but the main thing is they both love little kids Mike Vick was a legendary quarterback in the NFL his ultimate goal like many in the NFL is to win a Super Bowl but that ultimately did not happen and his comparison scar from Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood also had a goal of passing down judgment to all state alchemists but he did not complete it both of them had to go through trials and tribulations to realize what their goal really meant and how it can be reshaped and in the end they both realize what they need to do to live fulfilling lives while changing their viewpoints on life. And I would assume Mike and Scar are cat people after what they both did to dogs. Henry Ruggs and my boy Minato both had a lot of promise, but some things arose and now they're not really what they used to be. Henry, like Minato, is seen as one of the fastest in their generation. Henry had a 4.27 40-yard dash time, and Minato's nickname was the Yellow Flap. But one difference between the two is Minato can actually control his speed. John Cena is a WWE powerhouse. You know what else is a powerhouse? Attack on Titan. But John isn't Aaron, Levi, or even Mikasa. No, he's the ending of Attack on Titan. You can't see him, like how you'll never see this show in. Well, that was it. If you like my comparisons and thought they were accurate, which I know they were, give a thumbs up. I might do a part two. Don't forget to subscribe. I'll catch y'all later. Screaming out on the polo. I've been to myself in Dolo. Nigga been on no promo. I ain't never ever worried about a whole no. In the club, I've gathered the slow mo. All for